The United Nations Development Program UNDP has on Thursday 7 October 2021 handed over the renovated Upper Nile University campus in Malakal to the Ministry of Higher Education Science and Technology. The government of Japan funded the innovation work which started in June 2019. The implementing partner, the United Nations UNDP resident representative Samuel Toy said lectures halls, administration buildings and dormitories were uplifted. We are here to witness the Nankova, the launch, the new library at the Open Air University's main campus. Seeing all 29 buildings, lecture halls, administration buildings, teachers and student accommodation, laboratories, the library, the clinic, the cafeteria, etc., that have been brought back after a ravaging period as a consequence of conflict. The Vice Chancellor of the University, Professor Marielle Awo, said the institution that was destroyed by the 2013 conflict was renovated at the cost of two million four hundred thousand U.S. dollars. When the Hanan University located in Cuba, the total population was almost 2,000 staff, workers, and students. And today, it is not the same case. We are almost 6,000 persons in Cuba, including more than 4,000 students, about 1,900 support staff. Since 2014, the university has been operating temporarily in the capital, Cuba. As the construction of the university is almost finished, the vice chancellor of Upper Nile University said the main challenge which is remaining is the relocation of the students from Cuba to Malacan. On the relocation of the university to Malakal, this is what the Minister of Higher Education, Science and Technology, Gabriel Shang Son Chang, has to say. We have two plans. One is to relocate first year students, which number is about 1,000 or 900. That could be accommodated in these facilities. That will be the first step. The second step is to relocate agricultural uh, college in Rangi, agriculture and forestry. But again, those facilities, they need maintenance. So it is another challenge. So it will be a gradual relocation of the university. The minister said the relocation of the first-year students from Cuba to Malakal is expected to cost 50,000 U.S. dollars. For SSBC News, I'm Emmanuel Patrick, Malakal, Upper Nile State.